I'm Anthony, Director of Data Management Practice here at Synergial. So embracing artificial intelligence and all its capabilities, I think is going to require organisations to either revisit or reconsider their current data management arrangements. A really obvious example of this is around um, authorities of decision making, accountability and responsibility. So for example, if you took the deployment of some kind of artificial intelligent um, technology, that would be clearly within the gift and remit of the IT function. But that capability is going to be leveraging and consuming data. So again, that's going to be quite clearly defined and probably being the responsibility of your data function. But if you think about some of the unstructured data that might be consumed and leveraged in those tools, so documentation and likely that being stored in things like SharePoint, then that could be a grey area currently or ill-defined as to where that responsibility sits. If we spin that example out a little bit further in terms of, you know, let's say we're looking at some documentation, then who's actually making a decision about either the documents or the data or the information as to what should be accessible and leveraged in those tools and what shouldn't be. So this to me feels like a business leader's decision. Is there a specific role in the organization that should be making that decision or does it exist perhaps at a board level? But likely those decisions are gonna need some support and advice. And this is where I think you get the interplay. So here I'm thinking about the need for organizations to either establish or revisit their racy um, definitions. You know, so who should be consulted in those things? Probably legal, probably compliance to help inform those decision makers too. So I would summarize the fact that, you know, one of the things we need to do as we move forward, not just from a data management perspective and artificial intelligence, is to think about those things where we have to go back and look again. The last thought I would leave with as well is that um, when we think about all the different flavors of capabilities that we have to produce in organizations, so we always focus upon quality of data, you know, to be reliable and trustworthy, there are other things that artificial intelligence will require that probably move some of those capabilities up the rankings and change the order of priority. So a good example of that would be things like understanding the lineage and the provenance of the data. Where are these tools generating their responses from? That probably moves that requirement in the pecking order from previously. If you'd like to find out more and you need some support or guidance, then please go to our website, synergure.com. On there, you will find lots of resources to help you. Alternatively, you can contact the team.